In this lecture, we will review the WooCommerce Google Analytics integration plugin. I will show you how to set up a Google Analytics account and integrate it with Storefront. The first thing you should do is enable Google Analytics for your website. Go to the google.com analytics website. You can sign in or create a new account. Once you've set up your analytics, You'll be able to view your website traffic, see which countries send you the most visitors, and review the specific pages on your site that receive the most clicks as an example of some of the reports you'll see. You can create a new account or you can log in. If you already have an account, you can proceed to create a new property. Go to Admin. You can either create a new account add in the information or if you already have an account you can create a new property add in your website information your website name your website URL select your category your time zone and then click on get tracking ID since you're using WooCommerce the easiest way to integrate your store with an analytics account is through the WooCommerce Google Analytics integration plugin, which we'll do next. In your storefront dashboard, go to Plugins Add New. Type WooCommerce Google Analytics integration. Install now. Activate the plugin. This plugin will add the settings to the integration tab to be found in the WooCommerce settings menu. You'll add your Google Analytics ID in the box provided under the integration tab. Now you need to go back to your Google Analytics to find your ID. You'll find these details when you log back into your analytics account. It begins with a UA and some numbers. So in your analytics account, go to admin, select your account, go to property, tracking information, and tracking code. You'll copy this information this tracking ID and you will place it here. Fill in all the necessary fields for your store. Under tracking code I selected all of the options except for the display advertising. When done click on save changes. You can also set your domain name. It can take 24 hours for results to show in Google Analytics reports, especially if your analytics account is new. Finding your way around analytics can be a bit daunting. The program can be overwhelming at first, especially because there's so much to look at. So I suggest you take a quick tutorial from Google that will help you find your way around. The link is in the resources section. This little resource will help you get started with Google Analytics. Currently I have no stats because I just set my analytics up at this moment. But once you've set yours up, you'll be able to go through all the different reports. So I hope this helps you get started with Google Analytics. Please take a look at some of the resources available to you and if you have any questions, please feel free to post in the discussion forum. Thank you.